Hmm, I wonder what the human's doing. He's probably making something again, sitting at the table. I'll go see what he's doing. I haven't seen him in a while. And you know, this human can't do anything without me. Human! Human, where are you? I knew it. Hello, Barry. And you too, boys and girls. How are you doing, Barry? Look, human, can you do something interesting for me? So that I can play with my friends and all that. Hmm, ooh, I have an idea. I'll make you a drawing. Just a drawing? Nah, that's boring. Ah, but not any usual drawing. It will look like if it were alive. Can you picture it? To be honest, not really, human. Ah, then you're going to see it soon. First, I'll need a blank sheet of paper. And first, I'm going to fold it. But you're ruining the sheet. How are you supposed to draw on it if it's all crumpled? Don't you worry, Barry. I'm going to bring it to life for our future drawing. Now I'm going to fold it again, but in the other direction, like this, and smooth it out. So the paper is ready. Have you already decided what we're going to draw, Barry? Me, of course. You? Ah, so what colour do you prefer? Maybe green? What? It's obviously red, human. Come on. Oh, right, yeah, OK. I have a red marker. So, I already drew the silhouette of our bear with a pencil to make it smooth and accurate. Now let's start to trace it with a marker pen like this. But draw nicely, human, so it would look like real me. Of course, Barry. So, one paw, another paw, a third paw... Guys, guys, and while the human is drawing, tell me in the comments if I look like my portrait, or if the portrait looks like me, okay? And then I'll read it. Well, I think that's it, right? The most common berry, except a little chubby. But he's also chubby in real life. And now it's time for the most interesting part. Let's unfold the sheet. Hey, but it's empty there. Why is it empty in the middle of me, human? Hold on, now we're going to make a big scary mouth right here. Oh, wow! And using this drawing, you'll be able to prank all of your friends a little and scare them. Scare them? Wow, that's cool. I like it. And now let's draw terrible, terrible sharp teeth like this. I think it turned out scary. What do you think, guys? Now I only have to colour it. Everything is ready, Barry. Look, so like this, the portrait looks normal, but if you open it, it's an evil jelly monster. I think it turned out very cool. By the way, I think our viewers will also be able to draw something like this and surprise their friends. So, so cool, human. Now, give it to me. I'm going to go scare my friends, the animals. <laughs> now I'll show everyone this cool, this perfectly normal, harmless drawing. Oh, Minion, hello. Long time no see. Look what I have. It's my portrait. Look, look, a regular jelly berry, right? Hop, grrr. <laughs> ah, it's so cool. Well done, human, for inventing this thing. Finally, a really useful invention, and just for me. So, who else should I scare? Oh, right, I'm going to visit the crocodile. Usually he's not afraid of anyone, but I think now my drawing will fix that. <laughs> So, while Barry's running around with his terrifying portrait, I'm going to draw him another living picture. This will be the upper lip, and this one the lower. A little bigger, but that's okay. You've already guessed what kind of creature I'm drawing, right guys? Now, fins on the top and the bottom. That's right, it's a fish. Now, it looks pretty nice, but that's just for now. Hello, crocodile. I'm, uh, um, I brought you a picture. The minion was scared of it, but you're so big and strong. You probably aren't scared of anything in the world, right? <coughs> yes, of course, that is my portrait. But actually, no. <coughs> wow, guys, I didn't expect that this human invention would work so great. Even the huge crocodile was terrified. Okay, so who hasn't been scared today yet? Who hasn't seen my drawing? Ah, sure. Now I'm going to scare the animals. I'm going to... Oh, wait, you guys. After all, they probably already know about the secrets of the portrait because they saw how the crocodile and the minion were scared. Okay, okay, I'm going to go see the human and ask him to do a new scary picture, even cooler than this. So, it seems our fish is ready. 
Maybe our bear is going to be scared too. The picture seems nice, but then it opens up and... Huh? Human, human, human! Hmm? Yes, Barry? Did your friends like that picture? It was so cool! I scared the minion and even the big crocodile, you know? Probably because on the portrait I have more teeth than him. Oh, what is that beautiful drawing? Oh, this bear is a cute, colourful fish who turns into this one, scary and toothy. Ah! Holy wow! You got scared too! Barry, it's only a drawing, just like your portrait. Yeah, but it's so scary. Can I, can I take it with me? Of course, Barry, go on, take it. <laughs> the human made a fish for me. Look, friends, it's just a regular fish. Colourful and beautiful. <laughs> okay, everyone is here. So, do you want to look at the picture? That's right, it's so cool and so cute. But what if I do this? A scary toothy fish. I'm going to bite all of you. Well, I did scare all of you. Thanks to the human. Finally, he's made a really cool invention. Oh, I think I'm getting hungry. I'm going to eat a couple of candies. Human, human. What happened again, Barry? I scared everyone because this fish you drew is amazing. Oh, and what is that flask you have there? It's big. You know, I was going to perform a chemical experiment, so I'm preparing everything for it. A vessel and some reagents. I like the flask. It's so tall. Can I look into it? I'm going to climb into it. Now, oh, my candy fell right there. Hey, I wanted to eat that. <laughs> Classic berry. You never change. Well, what can I say? Try to get it. I'm trying, trying. But this flask of yours is too narrow. I'm not, uh, I can't get in. Can you turn it somehow? No, I can't. Ugh. Okay, no worries, Barry. I'll help you and show you and the guys a very cool, useful life hack. If some object ever fell in a narrow flask and you can't get to it, physics can help you. You know what I mean, Barry? No, I don't know any physics. Well, I'll show you. So all we need is sparkling water. You can use any. I have this one, for example. It's important that the bottle is new and never opened before. I pour the water straight into the flask and look, look Barry, look what's going on. Because of the gas bubbles, your candy didn't stay at the bottom, but it's risen along with the level of the liquid. Here you go. Candy! Yum, yum, yum. I mean, uh, thanks, human. Well, Barry, it's time to say goodbye to the boys and girls, isn't it? Wait, wait, wait. So I, uh, well, I got scared, watched the experiment, and now can I colour my portrait, please? Of course. You want a little creativity? Great idea. It's always good to change activities in order to rest. Yeah, I know. I'm a smart bear. Then take a brush. Oh, it fell. Why did you put it in my hind paw? Who draws with its hind paw? And here are the colours. Your portrait is probably going to be red, I'm guessing? Of course, human. Then go on and draw. I'm going to watch. After all, red is the best colour. Do you guys agree? Tell us in the comments. And if your favourite colour is other than red, then uh, also tell us. I do love reading your comments. It's going to be a really cool bear. I just have to finish the paw and the creepy bear is ready. Like this, like this, like this. I'm a natural born artist. Oh wow, Barry. Seems that the picture's even more frightening than before. Thankfully your friends haven't seen it, otherwise they'd be scared and hide. Yeah, but I'll show them anyway. And what can you tell the guys about this episode? Oh right, guys, it turns out that the simplest things can be turned into different interesting and very cool things, even live pictures. So, be creative. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you won't miss our future releases. And uh, give us likes. Oh, and also click on the bell. See you soon!